Hi everyone and welcome to our week one recap and update of this year's 2023 State Champs Amble Award presented by Hungry Howies. I'm Lauren Plant alongside Michigan High School football coach Hall of Famer Tim Beckler. Tim has a lot of love for these guys and we're talking about the guys who man the trenches. So let's put our initial top 10 on the screen right now. So for the last couple of years, Brandon Davis Swain has been making an impact for West Bloomfield. He has also been on the Anvil Top 10 numerous times. He is the top pass rusher in the class of 2023, getting ready to join primetime Deion Sanders out in Colorado. You like this player a lot. I love this player. Um, 6'4", 230, like we said, he's a senior. Watch this film, two things I thought was the first one was, wow, what a dangerous football player. And number two, his coaches let him have a lot of fun. I mean, he gets to play tight end, running back, D tackle, DN, kind of like an outside linebacker. He gets to do everything. That kid has to love game night. Um, but when he does play uh, tight end, he's a dominant blocker and he can run and catch the football. I mean, he's, he's a big man. He says 230, he might be a little bigger than that. Um, and then when he plays defensive tackle or uh, the rush end position, uh, man, do you run at him or away from him? Because I don't think it matters. He gets to the football. He's a natural, and what I mean by that is his, his hands are uh, just phenomenal. He attacks blockers, he sheds blockers. Um, when he pass rushes, he's got three rushes. He's got a bull rush. He's got, a, he can go outside you, inside with speed. He's got the club and rip, club and swim. Um, you can't single block this guy. You've got to have a back come on or, and chip and give that tackle help because he's just dominant. Um, but the best thing is he's just got a, a motor. Um, he's an angry pursuer of the football and man, he gets there and he arrives in a bad mood. Um, he's he's going to get to the football. Absolutely. He's a great player. A man with bad intentions. Uh, also was able to convert the two-point conversion to beat Chippewa Valley in week one. That was a huge moment for him. Are you a fan of, say you've got an excellent lineman, whether usually they're playing both sides of the ball, maybe not lining up though in the tight end side. Are you a fan of a guy, uh, of putting a guy out there, getting that much time on the field, knowing that um, what you really need him to do is what he does best, which is sack quarterbacks? Yes, but you've, you've got to be careful with that. And, and certainly when you're playing against a great team, I'm not going to rest him on defense. He is not coming off the field on defense, but offensively, you can get him a drink of water, get him some air, and then put him in in spots on offense. But uh, yeah, I would never take him off the field on defense. And when you're game planning, you just salivate at having an athlete like that, knowing that you can create specific plays in time that you can put the ball in his hands and let him just work defenders. Right. And football is not an easy game. And for him to be able to play that many uh, positions on defense and offensively, he's just a player. Um, and he's, his hands are phenomenal. He just attacks blockers and he gets off with ease. Uh, he's an amazing player. We're going to spotlight a guy every single week here on the State Champs Network as part of our extra point coverage each and every week. The voting for this year's Anvil Award will begin this weekend, if not sooner, so keep checking back at statechampsnetwork.com. You'll have an opportunity to vote for your favorite candidate. Now, the guy who leads the vote each week cannot be removed from the competition because I'm telling you right now, there are guys determined to play their way into the race. Perfect case in point. Northville's Ferris Jordan. We want to give him a shout out. The fact that Mustangs went out and defeated Clarkson 24 to 10. Just a beautiful interception to help seal the deal. We see you, Ferris. This is a fluid competition and players will fall out of the top 10 and players will play themselves in. So this list at some point is going to change. Vote as often as you like beginning this weekend at statechampsnetwork.com.